Let's talk content creator to content creator. I messed up my shoulder somewhere. It must be from doing the weights, but content creator to content creator. Here is how I became proactive for my 2024 goals in business. I decided that I want to focus on a more passive income streams this year. I was able to get my writing business to a really nice figure. I'm happy with that. But most of my writing business is trading my time for money. And I know very well because I follow a lot of mentors. I have a specific mentor that's my guide. They know that you can only make so much if you're trading your time for money. And so one of the beauties of technology today and being a content creator is the sky is not even the limit. You can go beyond the sky and universes. So how do you get there though? Because it's very overwhelming. There is an affiliate program for everything. There are so many different ways to make money online. How do you know what is right for you? Well, obviously I know that writing is for me. I love writing and now you can use that writing skill on social media. You can use it on blogs. You can use it on websites. You can use it for Etsy. You can use it as a fiber gig. There are so many ways you can use your writing skill to make money online. And that is what I'm going to talk about today. So if you are out there as a writer wondering, oh my gosh, how can I make money? Well, here you go. This year I decided that I want the passive streams. I started saying that at the beginning of the video. So what are passive income streams? They're streams that more often than not, you've got to do a little bit of time in the beginning. You get them kind of all set up and then you kind of you sit back and you mention them or have a link in your bio and people will click the link in your bio and then you will start making in, uh, money without really putting in a lot of time. Like I said, these will include some time in the front, front end, but they don't include time altogether. So let's say you put a 40 hours, a 40 hour work week into this one passive income stream, you're one and done, it's all set up for the year and you just have fun talking to people and writing on social as you would do and networking with people and as they need whatever it is is your, what your um, expertise is, like for me, it's goal success coaching. Um, they'll just come to you and ask you, you know, most people actually come to me for writing as well. They hire me for broken links on their website. They hire me to write SEO content. They hire me to kind of go through their blog and update old blog posts or content for food blogs. So I'm kind of that go-to writer for a lot of bloggers, but people also come to me for advice on how can I get like my goals set up and like achievable? Like how can I be successful this year? And this is how you're going to be successful. You're going to set these passive income streams up. And we're going to focus on a couple of them. So this year I am focused personally on two social media sites. How did I come to that conclusion that I want to really show up in these two social media sites more than others? Well, the number one reason is these two sites have a, have more of an opportunity for me to monetize them and make some income from them now or in the near future, such as at the end of the year when I've built them up a little more, or I'm already making a small amount of revenue. Now, if I show up more, I'll make more money. So there are two social platforms that I am showing up more on. I'll give you a hint. YouTube's one of them. And that way I can monetize them and make some money in that way. I also am getting money on the back end because brands and product people are coming in and saying, Hey, I, you know what? I want to send you a product or I want to pay you to feature our product that you already use. Right? So my rise mushroom coffee, I'm over there on Instagram and Facebook talking about it every day, but I'm actually paying for it. However, I'm an affiliate with them now because I like the product. I buy the product. I use the product. So that's how I'm making money on my, on my two social media channels right now. And as I set these videos up and record them in the text, the public, status updates and the public videos, people start coming in from search engines and on YouTube, they have their own kind of algorithm. I show up there. So those are some really good ways to set up a passive income stream using affiliate links, products you already use and your writing skill. Now I also have in my link tree account, it's a, you'll see, I believe the link is most of my bios online. You will see that you can learn how to start a blog flipping business, which is, and start a blog. I have a tutorial how to start a blog as well. So you go ahead and you get in there, you get the ebook, you get started, you use your writing skills to start a blog flipping business, which means you're going to build the blog, you're going to write the blog posts, you're going to get it to the point of where you are ready to sell it. And my ebook goes into kind of how, how to know when you want to sell and what your goals are. And then you start flipping those blog, blog sites. It's about 2% of my revenue at the moment. So I don't do a lot with it, but I do have the guides out there to help other people who want to advance that part of their income stream or start it this year. I'm trying to think, what else do I have? So I have coloring books and I have journals. Those are again, one-off things that go on my buy me a coffee 
youtube.com forward slash Brandy Ellen. The link will be in the description for that, as well as my other link tree link where you can find everything I'm kind of talking about here. And buy me a coffee is a great site because you can write blog posts, you can write, you can add upload products like printable journals and printable trackers. Um, you can have a wish list. Right now I have a wish list for a background green screen thing that can actually go on my chair so we can change the backgrounds on my videos, right? Because I'm on YouTube more, I'd like to have a better background. And so that's just a bunch of different ways that I started making money this year. I focused on where am I showing up the most? Where am I getting the most clicks? Because if you're already online and you're already pretty active as a content creator, you have access to analytics. Look, what does your audience want? Where are they clicking? You know, people are clicking at my coloring book, but they weren't buying it. So I thought, well, you know what? It's $5 for a 10 page printable coloring book. I put it down to $3 and free for members. And we'll see, maybe people will be more interested in that, right? If it's $3 for a 10 page coloring book that I created. And then my two social channels that get the most clicks, that's why I'm focusing on them because people are actually clicking on stuff I'm sharing, which means I'm reaching enough people who want something. They want to know more. They're curious about what I offer. And so if I show up more, I explain a little more on the backside for free. How do you make money online? What's going on in my, my mental health and physical health world? You know, right now I'm walking every day. All these different pieces of things that I do narrow back down into my skill of writing. I'm writing. I'm share, I'm writing to share my daily walk. I'm writing to share my mushroom coffee. I'm writing to share my buy me a coffee site. I'm writing to share product reviews and sponsorships. I am not, however, as you can tell, writing YouTube scripts. I'm torn on YouTube scripts because as much as you as a writer out there, you totally can do that as a revenue stream. Write other people's scripts for their videos. I think if you looked at the Y files, he's actually hiring a script writer, 2,500 words. So there's opportunity out there for script writers as well. But I don't like script writing because I'm practicing showing up as me and saying whatever is coming to me because I firmly believe the spirit is telling me, hey, Brian, you got to share this, you got to share that. And as I start to share more and trust what I'm supposed to share today, my talking and my videos will get better. And I'd rather enjoy watching that process from messy to less messy, although it'll always be chaos because I am a happy, chaotic soul. I hope that the rambles today gave you a little insight on what to do for writing and setting goals and sticking with them. I'm actually going to share my cheat, cheat, was it cheat code? cheat code, my cheat code, my cheat code to goal setting success soon. And I can't wait to show you how I personally set goals, achieve them, check them off and just thus always have something I'm working towards so that I am happier and, and more joyful in life. I hope there were some tidbits in this video and I will try to narrow down my next video on actual subjects because I know some of you out there are bloggers looking to make more money using AI. You're looking to see how you can be better at time management. I have all of those things I want to share more of because even though I have some time management videos, I will link up here a time management video. I've tweaked how I do it now. And as you learn and grow, you keep tweaking the systems you use. So go ahead and check out the time management video and best reviewer videos over here. I will see you uh, in the short section and we'll have another long video maybe later in the week. Be well.